Hi everyone and welcome to this video. In this video we want to find the value of this expression which is 9 divided by 3 then times 2 plus 1. Are you ready to solve? Let's go ahead and get started. 2 plus 1 gives us 3 and 3 times 3 equals 9. So 9 divided by this 9 gives us just 1. But this answer is not correct. Because according to the order of operations, which is PEMDAS, PEMDAS, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponents, M and D stands for multiplication and division, and A and S stands for addition and subtraction. We first do parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication and division, and finally addition and subtraction. As we know, multiplication and division have equal priority, and we have to work from left to right, and the same applies to addition and subtraction. So here, first we do these parentheses. So, 2 plus 1 gives us just 3. So, 9 divided by 3 times just 3. No, we have this division and this multiplication. Division and multiplication have, ho have equal priority and we have to work from left to right. So first, this division, 9 divided by 3 gives us 3. And 3 times 3 equals just 9. So our final answer to this problem is just 9. Two divided by two divided by two and again divided by two. Are you ready to solve? Let's go ahead and get started. Two divided by two equals one. And again we have here two divided by two, which equals one. So one divided by one gives us one. But this answer is not correct. Because according to the order of operations, we have to work from left to right. So here, first we do two, 2 divided by 2, which equals 1. Then divided by 2, and again divided by 2. 1 divided by 2 equals 1 over 2, then divided by 2. Here, according to the KCF rule, K stands for keep, C stands for change, and F stands for flip. 1 over 2 divided by 2, according to this rule, can be written as 1 over 2 times 1 over 2. And this is equal to 1 over 2 times 2 equals 4. So our final answer to this problem is 1 divided by 4. Four minus four equals zero, and zero times two minus two uh, four gives us negative two. So zero times negative two equals zero. But this answer is not correct because according to the order of operations, which is PEMDAS, PEMDAS, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponents. M and D stands for multiplication and division, uh, and A and S stands for addition and subtraction. We first do parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication and division, and finally addition and subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority, and we work from left to right. And the same goes for addition and subtraction. So here, we first do these parentheses. 4 minus 4, then times 2 minus 4 gives us negative 2. Now, uh, we first do this multiplication. So, 4 minus 4 times negative 2. 
4 times negative 2 gives us negative 8. And this is equal to 4 minus times negative 8 gives us plus 8. And 4 plus 8 equals 12. So our final answer to this problem is 12. Parentheses, 6 times 3 square, then divided by 3. Are you ready to solve? Let's go ahead and get started. According to the order of operations, which is PEMDAS, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponents, M and D stands for multiplication and division, and A and S stands for addition and subtraction. We first do parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication and division, and uh, finally addition and subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority, and we work from left to right. And the same applies to addition and subtraction. In this expression, we have these parentheses and this division. According to PEMDAS, first uh, we have to handle these parentheses, and inside these parentheses, we have this multiplication and this exponent. Uh, first, we do 3 square. 3 square equals 9. So, parentheses 6 times 9 divided by 3. 6 times 9 equals 54. So, 54 divided by 3. And this is equal to 18. So, our final answer to this problem is just 18. Four divided by one over four, then times four. Our goal is to find the value of this expression. Are you ready to solve? Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, here uh, we have one over four and times four. We can easily cancel this four and this four. So four divided by just one, and this is equal to four. But this answer is not correct. Because according to the order of operations, which is PEMDAS, multiplication and division have equal priority, and we have to work from left to right. So here, first uh, we have to handle this division. Okay, 4 divided by 1 over 4. According to the KCF rule, K stands for keep, C stands for change, and F stands for flip. Keep the first fraction, which is 4 over 1. And change division to multiplication, and flip the second fraction. Okay, so our expression equals 4 times uh, just 4 and again times 4. 4 times 4 equals 16, and 16 times 4 gives us 64. So, our final answer to this problem is 64.